Hi friends, welcome to the channel of learning by doing. Today we are going to talk about the table tag in the HTML5. And uh, the table tag is uh, a common which is in the HTML also. But we are going to learn in the simple steps. Uh, the table tag is going to be start with uh, the table as uh, the name. And uh, it's going to be end with slash table as usual. Um, and in between the table tags, we are having the two types of an elements or add, uh, elements within it. That is nothing but the th and the tr th is nothing but the table heading and tr is nothing but the table row guys okay you got it right and if you want to give something uh, uh, within the row i mean in the first row i want to give some headings for my table then we we have to write that first row within the first row tags that is the row has to be end with slash tr and within that we are going to give the th that is the headings of the first row as name and um, I'm going to give as age this is my first heading for the first row and the second heading I'll just copy it I don't want to try it again 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 uh, so I'll just copy it and I'm going to paste it here as um, uh, I'm going to paste it three, uh, three headings for my first row of a table so I'm going to write it as um, name age and uh, down I'm going to write as gender okay okay guys this is the heading of my for, uh, for heading which is going to be displayed in the top of the table that is in the first row and if you want to give some content for this i mean the data data for the table we are going to see this uh, control c i'm going to paste it within the table tag in the second row we are going to give the content right that is nothing but the data then we doesn't use the heading tag as th table heading we'll give it as td as the table data and it's going to be end as the td itself and here also i'm giving as td and it's going to be end as td itself uh, this, um, okay guys this is also td as usual t sorry td um, and it's automatically giving td okay guys this is nothing but this and i'm giving the name as name one and age as um, two years and uh, the gender to be as the female or male i'm giving the gender as male okay okay guys this is nothing but the table tag which is having the table rows and the table uh, headings and the table data within it and uh, what is the output and how it's going to be look we'll see here or uh, okay uh, i'm going to save this and we'll see in the chrome how it's going to be look uh, see i didn't get any table like format for that purpose we are going to be introduced one of the attribute within the table uh, that is nothing but the border i need the border to my table to be as um, one we are not using any cell padding and all this here we are just using the border for our table so i'm going to save this and we are going to look how it's going to be look in our web page yes this is nothing but the table um, a border uh, which is nothing but the table tag in the html5 and now we are going to be look about the another type of tag called the progress tag which is very new tag which was introduced in the html5 okay guys i'm going to open my notepad plus plus again and uh, in the for this we are going to introduce one of the tag called the progress tag uh, i'm going to show you what is progress tag it is very nice you know i i i really seen very uh, attractive this tag because you are also going to be see how this progress tag is going to be work if you want to do some i didn't write anything in the progress i'm just putting this progress and um, we'll see how it's going to be work i didn't see in this here i just um, see guys that was progressing that the, blo the block was moving from this side to this side this is nothing but the progress tag and uh, uh, if we give in the progress tag to be having the, the progress tag is also having one of the two attributes that is within it the as um, value and um, value and what is the maximum value for it and we'll see it progress tag is having the attribute as value I'll give the value as um, 70 okay 70 and uh, the maximum value should be as um, 100 um, 
and within this progress tag i am putting some uh, we doesn't give any uh, uh, we will put some uh, 70 percent and all this uh, okay we will see how it's going to be look i really love do seeing this because uh, see guys I, when i given that uh, progress tag as is normal it was just started moving but uh, when i given some value to it it was get stopped within 70 percent of uh, uh, within the 70 percent the block was closed right that is nothing but the progress tag and uh, we are having the another tag also here that is the meter tag we are having the meter tag in this um, I'm, I'm going to show you what is the meter tag uh, but uh, today for today classes these uh, two tags was enough for you and in the next classes I'll tell you about uh, the, some more tags of it thanks for watching this video if you like my video just subscribe to my channel